Hello guys, AGO Creations here. Welcome back to another Minecraft video. In today's Minecraft video, I'm going to be showing you how to use the fill command to make an awesome door that functions like this. Alright, so before we get to that, there's also the set block command, which also allows for door variation like that one, that can just slide and slide away. But first, you need to know where to start with this set block and the fill command. First of all, if, if you want to learn to use the set block command, you only need one set of coordinates. With the fill command, you need two sets of coordinates. But it's not hard to do. Once you have both, then you have the simplistic design. This only uses two command blocks on each side. This one uses 16 in total. There's eight command blocks on both sides, equaling equal, which equals to 16. The only difference is it's the set block command, allowing such smooth and rapid speed. Now if you yourself want to copy th your this design and use your own coordinates oops now oh, looks like a coordinate was missed. I'm betting you it was probably right here. So, to help you understand how the set block and the fill command are similar, but not entirely the same, they are similar, but vaguely different. When putting in the set block command, oops, I did double. With the set block command, once you have your coordinates, then you have a problem. Does that mean? Once fixed, behold, the best creation possible, there, and then, phew, it's beautiful, it's gorgeous, but it's complicated at, at best. The commands are simple. The commands usual utilize a lot of redstone, redstone repeaters, and redstone it dust itself. This only uses two commands, and is more simplistic. So you just need one set of coordinates where your first block is, and then you need another set where your second coordinates are. And you just repeat it all over with the fill command. It's the same with the set block. However, they work different from one another. It's beautiful, though. But, it's not complicated. I recommend that you try and play around with it and see what you can create. If you can create anything with the set block command, try to, try to create 
a door of some kind, or even an elevator, if you can. It doesn't matter what you create, as long as it works. Which is highly possible, because if I'm able to make a moving door, I think a moving elevator is possible. And the player would be able to, they would continuously move with it, because they would be teleported every time the elevator moved, and it would seem so smooth. But, of course, this is Bedrock, so... Minecraft Bedrock Edition has its limits with command blocks. Java Edition, there is no limit. If you want to go above and beyond in Java Edition, there's nothing holding you back. Bedrock, there is. But, of course, it's not that hard. I will see you at the intro. Uh, <clears throat> place. I wonder what's underneath this carpet. Hmm. Hello, anyone down there? Hello? Hello, anyone down there? Hmm. No one there. Or apparently I was wrong. Uh, I cup and peace? Maybe I should just get the door? can't hit me. You're not gonna kill me. You can try, but your crossbow is not gonna do anything. Come on, you gotta try better than that. Is that all you can do? Oh, wait. Well, since I'm about to die, I would say this. Oh, she fell, she fell down. Well, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I also have, as I've said before, in the future, hit that little bell. But I don't have it.